Hello students, I be back with the new video. Standard 4th subject EVS 1 Science Lesson 9 Air. Students, open your textbook page number 57. Lesson 9 Air. Children, look here. Can you tell what are the people in the pictures doing? The man is pumping the air inside the cycle tube. She is blowing the balloon. This man is filling the air in his car tire. Let us learn more about the air through this activity. One. Here we have taken one container filled with water and other one narrow container that we kept on the water upside down position. And when we pressed that narrow container into the water, what happens children? Yes, water will not enter in that small container. Now, we will tilt that narrow container a little. We can see water is entered in that small container. And we can see some bubbles are coming out from the container and moving upwards. Isn't it? How it happened? Why water is not entered in the first position? Because the empty container has air. We say that the container is empty, but the container is filled with the air. When we tilted that container a little, the air from the container escaped out and it moved upwards. And the water got the place to enter in the container. Got the students? Means air was there in the empty container earlier. What does this tell us? Air is lighter than water. So air bubbles rise to the top as soon as the container is tilted. It means that there was air even in the container that appeared to be empty. Moving to the activity second. Here some papers they are arranged one above the other. Can you see the difference of upper layer and down layers? Yes, down papers, they are pressed and more pressure is there. But on the upper layers, less weights are there. What does this tell us? The lower layers bear more weight than the upper layers of paper. Compared to that, the upper layers bear less weight. Now, atmosphere. What is atmosphere, students? Yes, the earth on which we live is round in shape like a ball. There is air all around the earth. This covering of air around the earth is called the atmosphere. As we go farther from the earth, the layers of air become thinner. The air at a greater height is rare. Here I end this video. Remaining part of this lesson I will continue in the next session. Thank you.